refugees do have a right to return and a framework that enables them to exercise this right uh, in line with international standards would be welcome. First and foremost, this means that return must be voluntary and take place in safe and dignified conditions that pave the way for lasting solutions. At present, conditions in Myanmar's Rakhine state are not in place to enable safe and sustainable returns. Refugees are still fleeing, and many have suffered violence, rape, and deep psychological and physical harm. Some have witnessed the deaths of family members and friends. Most have little or nothing to go back to, uh, their homes and villages destroyed. It is critical that returns do not take place precipitously or prematurely without the informed consent of refugees or the basic elements of lasting solutions in place. People must have the option of returning home and not be confined in specific areas. Progress towards addressing the root causes of flight, which includes the lack of citizenship as recommended by the Rakhine Advisory Commission, will also be crucial.